Coach, the Pistons were the ones with the big turnaround in the second half in this game. What did your guys have to do to just get back into it? Well, our defense picked up. You know, they made, you know, teams make run, and they made a heck of a run. We got down as many as 10, and I think I took a timeout and screamed a little bit, and when we came back in that fourth quarter, our defense really picked up. We kept getting stop after stop, and then, you know, we made some shots to get us back in it, and once we got ahead, then JR made some big buckets. Raymond made two big shots. You know, I mean, total team effort again. Raymond was said he was still upset after the game about his, his turnovers in the first half. But what were some of the things he, he did to come up big in that second half? Well, he didn't turn it over, and he made shots and ran our ball club. Uh, the first quarter, I mean, we had seven turnovers in seven minutes. And on the road, you can't do that. I mean, you got to give yourself an opportunity to score the ball. That was seven possessions. We came up empty, and they scored, I think, on five of the seven possessions. So, you know, we just you can't start games that way. And... You know, especially on the road because you give team life, you know, at home. Hey, then it's, it's a dog fight the rest of the way. But, you know, I thought we held our composure when we took the lead and then we gave it back. And, and then they took the lead and then we were able to do what we've been pretty much doing all year. We held in there in that fourth quarter and defended and got the lead back and ended up pulling it home. These last two games give you a little bit of confidence about what your team can do without Carmelo out there? I mean, again, I, <laughs> Melo's a big piece. To, care how you slice it, you know, he's a big piece to our to our ball club. And you know, we've had games this year where he's missed, and we've been successful. And again, that's a sign of a true team, a team that's willing to step up and make plays and win. You know, regardless of who's in in uniform. And uh, uh, it was a total team effort again tonight. I mean, after being down 25 in Cleveland and and then 10. Late in the game tonight, you know, we were able to rally and get it done. What did you think of uh, Stoudemire in that first half? Is that as good as you've seen him? In? He was pretty good. I mean, but Stad's been great since he's come back. He's been one of the most consistent players coming off the bench and um, and scoring at a high rate. I mean, per minute, he's 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 produced some nice numbers for us. So I mean, it's nice to see how he, he started tonight. Uh, and um, ended up having a solid game for us. You guys leave with a win, but was this as frustrated as you've ever been during the game, especially the first half? Not really. I mean, again, you know, we, you know, our defense was solid. They only scored 77 points. So, I mean, I can't complain too much about that. Only thing I was have complaints about is us, you know, the 20 turnovers. That's so not like us. I mean, we lead the league and not turning it over. and. I pride our team on that. You know, you're going to play offense and good offense. You got to get shots and good shots. And we didn't give ourselves 20 opportunities to to, to get a good shot. To start the second half with Stoudemire in there instead of Kurt, why did you decide to? Well, I mean, I I think I did that in Cleveland too. Um, his minutes were at about 11 minutes, 11, 12 minutes the, the first half. So. Now I can pour on the minutes, so that's why I started it. Mike, you said the other night, like in Cleveland, they could have just, you know, put their heads down and they'd come here. We, the way, on an individual level, the way it started for Raymond tonight, but the way he hung up, can you talk about that a little bit? Well, Raymond was, you know, he was ugly early. Yeah. And, you know, I kind of read him the riot act a few times in the timeout, and he responded, which was kind of nice, um, especially down the stretch. He made big plays after big plays, so... Uh, Raymond has been solid all year for us, so I'm, it's kind of nice to see him perform the way he did tonight. At the end of that third quarter, that run as he was 10-0, I think he scored the last seven for you. He took How over. He that took that over the game, and you know, got us back in it. And then Jr. You know, we got the ball moved around and ran some some pretty good offense, and guys were able to break loose for some nice some nice looks, and they made the shots. Mike, that will be game time tomorrow. Yes. Yes.